really don't have much of a mission today. I don't know. I'm, I might get on the water if things look good. It's a south wind. I'm going to a south boat ramp. So we'll see. Never really have much of a plan. Just kind of go where the wind doesn't blow. Okay, so uh, I thought this was the boat ramp. Just hit a dead end and a lock gate. So I got to figure out where else I can go now. That's why we drive around and check these things out. All right, guys, we found ourselves a ramp. Sun's out, the wind is blowing, but let's get on the water. I'm feeling good about it. All right, you guys, and we're on the water. Met a super nice uh, fellow kayak angler from Florida, Robert Phillips on the ramp. Said he caught a couple small ones today. This like is in play for the Kissimmee chain. So I'm gonna go out. It's it's rocking pretty good, but this south side is protected. We're gonna go out and explore a little bit. See if we can find. Big gator. We ain't messing around with those anymore. I'm still a little uh, on edge from that last one at Eufaula. Well, you guys, I just got rocked out there for hours. Didn't take a single bite, so I'm a little humbled. Um, I really can't ride off this lake though because I don't know if those fish were shut down with how crazy that wind is. That very well could be the case. Not totally sure. But all in all, I think what I'm going to do for the rest of the day, I'm going to go back to the ramp. Uh, my truck and my trailer desperately need to be cleaned out. I haven't even rigged for Florida yet. I'm just being super lazy. So I might get that done and bright and early tomorrow. We're going to get back out on a new lake, fish a little bit before my flight takes off. bite though so far. I don't know about that y'all. Good morning y'all. JJ Go <laughs> JJ Gray and Mofro. Y'all are welcome. That is one of my tournament playlist staples. First tournament of the year on the road. Um, yeah, so I don't know if you guys watch my practice video before this, but as I was detailing, I got a day and a half of practice. Um, the lake that I have history on totally changed. The grass is all gone. I went there yesterday with the sole intention of riding it off. And you guys, it literally gave me just enough to get me to drive the hour and a half uh, and put all my eggs in this basket. So I have no idea what today is gonna bring. When the east wind picks up, I'm gonna be have I'm gonna have a really really rough day. My I, I, that's the worst possible win for this bite. Um, but I have a window and I've got to capitalize on it. I think so. I'm not sure if it's the right decision or not. We are gonna try. Uh, we are gonna try. I'm a little bit nervous, but here's the deal: when you're a tournament angler, sometimes you have to be a little bit risky and you have to kind of go big in order to have big results. So that's what we're doing today, you guys. We'll see you at the boat ramp. All right, guys, we made it to our spot. Um, essentially, what I'm gonna be doing this morning, I'm gonna be fishing um, kind of a swim bait on top of the water to start with. Fish, I'm really keyed in on the Kissimmee grass here. The hydrilla, a lot of it's gone, and this lake was chock full of it, so I was feeling that those fish should be more concentrated. Got a couple really good bites around the Kissimmee grass. That's enough for me. Uh, to kind of run that pattern a little bit before the wind picks up and comes out of the east because this is the west bank. So I'm going to try to fish this semi grass, see if we can't get some bites out of it, some good bites. Then we might tuck back in the boat lane and flip some reeds. That's the plan. It's probably going to change in about 10 minutes. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's a freaking big bass on the top water. Come on, get out of the grass. Holy shoot, you guys, that's a giant. Stay on. Stay on. 
Oh, it's freaking buried. Come on, get out of there. Get out of there. That's a giant. Yes! Woo! Yeah, boy. Look at that thing. Instinct paid off big on that one. Yes! And slow rolling. That big paddle tail on top of the water. Heck yes, you guys, that's a freaking beast. At that 22 incher, you guys, that is a massive fish, yes. Woo, told you guys, that's what we're keying in on. Let's get some more, yes. Go from giant fish to a catastrophe. <laughs> Oh boy, that's a typical tournament for this girl, you guys. Kind of getting to where I can see the individual clumps of grass. We're gonna pick that apart. Freaking sub foil. Oh, All right, so that one didn't pan off, but it could have. You gotta keep your head on a swivel if you see something. Any little movement, you got to be ready for that. One. Saw some bait flicking right there, so I popped that bait in. Boom, got him. Thing looked a lot bigger than it was when it was flopping around the air out there. It was a 15 and a quarter, or 15 and a half. Well, that sucked. I felt, felt like a dang zoo critter. The one on that airboat was just staring at me. Okay guys, it is now 11.30. I haven't had a bite since that last fish I missed. Uh, definitely wasn't expecting that, so I'm switching it up a little bit. Um, came to a completely different side of the lake to get out of the wind. We might fish some reeds. Um, let's see what these reeds look like. I don't know how much water are on these. But, gotta do something different, try to get bit. The sun's coming out, so I figured it might be time to do a little flipping. All right, you guys, I'm going to do that thing again. It's 12, 15. Term ends at 3. I need one bite each hour. I need three fish. That's why I got to look at it. One bite an hour. Let's try. Let's mentally stay in this.
today. Holy smokes, I was not expecting that. Water temp is still 61, 62, just like it was yesterday. Um, not having hardly any practice definitely kind of hurt, and this leg has changed a little bit. I really thought I was on to something first thing in the morning, getting that giant uh, on that, getting that giant on top water. But that was all she wrote. Did get a limit though, and gotta be paused, gotta be happy about that. I'm gonna take what I can get. Had a good day out in the water. Um, probably not, but again, worked my tail off, got that limit, didn't come up with the fish shy, so that's exciting. I'm gonna go load up. We got it, we got day two tomorrow. I'm not coming back here, you guys. I'm gonna go um, fish a lake side unseen and just see what we can do. So stay tuned for day two.